hey, in the last video, or the one before that, I don't know. Anyway, I, I said how nobody's gonna give you $2 if you don't appreciate one. And that is key. That's one of the top first things you need to get, understand be, in, on the road to success and freedom in life. Because it, it's one of the key things that you really have to master first. It's one of the first steps you must take. And that is you have to learn to appreciate the little things first before you get to the big things. Everybody wants the big things. They just want to hop right to the good stuff, the big stuff. They want the, the big house, the fancy car, the money, the rich life. And you can't just go from here to here without taking the steps to get there. And one of the first steps you have to take is you have to realize those big things are made up of lots of little things. That car has 20,000 pieces, and if one of those pieces starts to not work right, you, you, you don't, it's like you don't appreciate an alternator until it starts to break down. It's, it's like a piece of your body. It's like a liver or a kidneys or, 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 the, or the heart or the brain. If it starts to go, then you really start to appreciate what that little quiet thing how important that is. You got to realize your, your body, your car, your house, they're made up of thousands or millions of little parts and they all depend on each other. And you have to learn to appreciate every little one of those because every little rich people, rich people got rich by making money off of lots of little tiny transactions. You know, Walmart was based, or name any place, name any place that, that sells a million things. Uh, a shoelace company, a toilet paper company, they don't cost much, but there's millions of people that need shoelaces and toilet paper, all made from little things that cost pennies. Uh, you know, and that is what you have to realize. It's like, everybody wants to grab the big thing right away. They want the big, rich thing. But that thing couldn't even be built. A space shuttle could not go into space. Look how important an O-ring is. A little rubber band blew up the space shuttle. That's how important it was. Every little tiny part is so important. And until you give full value and appreciation to all the little tiny things in life, you're never going to get to the big things. And this is key. Everybody wants to, you can't step over that. And it's a lesson you have to learn. And it, it is a way that, that has to become part of you. Um, I remember I, I was sitting at a, at a traffic light with somebody and, um, and there was a, uh, a beggar on the street. He was pretty, pretty nasty looking. And the person I was with smiled and said, look at those nice shoelaces or something like that. He had something nice that she found the tiniest little thing that was, she found something nice to say about it. And that is what your life is. Your life can be nasty. It can be just horrible. But there's something, anything. Find that one little tiny thing that's beautiful, that you can appreciate. If it's a flower growing through the crack in the sidewalk in front of your house, if it's the way, the tone of somebody's voice, if it's just the sound of silence when everybody's gone, there's always something to be thankful for. That's where you start. That's the first step on your road to success. Stop focusing on the negative things and start looking for the little positive, beautiful things in life. They're everywhere. Even the horrible situations in life, there's something, even if it's like you're with somebody you hate, maybe the sound of their voice is soothing, maybe they dress nice, maybe whatever it is, start focusing on the good stuff, not the bad stuff. And the more you do that, you're building a foundation brick by brick to get yourself out of the muck that you're in. And that is such an important step. You gotta appreciate the little things and they add up. All those little things add up to make a big thing. Doesn't happen overnight, but you got to start, you know, stepping up those steps to get higher up in life. That is key. It is key. And you should, you can never stop doing that. And the more you see something to appreciate, you know, even bad people, evil people, whatever, you know, they only see bad. They only know how to rip people off and stuff like that. Well, what they're doing is they're looking for something in that person that they can take advantage of. Now, that's a negative angle on it, 
but they're still doing the same thing. They're looking for something to appreciate that they can use. Now, your job, being a good person, is to do the same thing, but in a good way. Because it all catches up to you, it all comes back to you. The bad stuff comes back to the bad people, the good stuff comes back. Anyway, the point is that that is one of the secrets of success. You have to know this, that you know, the, the Rolls Royce is, is built on a million quality parts. A Ferrari is a million quality parts, handcrafted by 200 people. A space shuttle, uh, the, the house, the whatever it is. They're all made from little parts and you have to learn to appreciate little things in life. Okay, that's my thing. It's, it's like the big things are made of little things and they're paid for by lots of little things. The, the presidents of companies got rich because they were selling something that was small and affordable to, to normal people. Whatever it is, you know, if, if, if it's a, a hamburger that costs 99 cents or it's a cheap pair of shoes, somebody found a way to make those shoes inexpensive. So now a million people are buying them and the guy just made $10 million because he found a way to sell little things that people can appreciate. Get what I'm saying? There, there is, for every Rolls Royce that sells, there's 10,000 Volkswagens that sell. <laughs> Uh, little things, the smaller things, they move faster. There's more of them. So I don't know if that was a good example, but you, you know what I'm saying. It, it, the little things. Learn to, when, when you are miserable in life, when you got nothing, and it starts, and, and I'm, I'm saying look for things that you can take advantage of or use. I'm saying just learn to appreciate. When you're miserable, go outside, just plop yourself down on the ground and just look at a blade of grass and, and just marvel at its wonder how resilient this stuff is and how a little flower can grow out of a piece of cement or, or how this fly is, is studying you or how, how great it feels to have the warmth of sunlight on your the fact that there's even a sun in the sky. I mean, learn to appreciate stuff. It changes your whole way of looking at things and that energy changes and that's one of the starts. All that other stuff, the success stuff, that comes naturally down the road. Don't go for the success. Go for the the way of looking at life. That's the first thing you have to change is your perspective. So that's your lesson. I'm telling you, this is a serious foundation. It's, you have to do this. And if, uh, if you're just looking for things to gripe about, you're doing the opposite. And I'm gonna, that, that's one of my next videos. But for now, the foundation, one of the key foundations for getting on the road to success, getting further ahead in life, is to learn to appreciate the little things first. Stay tuned for more.